and welcome back. I'm your host, False ID, and this is Things VTubers Say, where we promote English-speaking VTubers that you should be following right now. And please welcome Vey Bay. Yes, it is Vey. They are here once again. They will be producing a live 2D debut soon and also letting us know that V Shoujo's Silver Veil is a cutie. So what's all this about live 2D debut? Here's my final live 2D reference sheet. This will be my official design. I hope you all like it. Made Succubus. Illustration by Neon Beat 619 and live 2D rigging by Kefi. That's right. The same modeler as Kiryu Koko. The same modeler as Takanashi Kiera, the same modeler as Kareji Ali, now is going to be modeling this for us. Wow. Holy smokes. That's right, folks. This is going to be a spicy episode. So yes, live 2D, very popular with VTubers. And when given the opportunity to have one of the best modelers to set up your model, it very much makes sense to try it out, doesn't it? And yet it's still very surprising. They already has a fan fantastic model that has 3D tracking and lots of movement that has been very quintessential to how we know they getting into the spirit of the VTuber uprising showing off shots like this that of course could only be accomplished in 3D and anyone who knows they also knows of their numerous dance videos showing off a multitude of moves that of course could only be done in 3D just gonna take a moment here to watch a little bit more just a little bit more i can stop whenever i want and it doesn't stop there amazing celebrity collabs such as this one of course could not be accomplished unless in 3d but whether they are in 3d or 2d they will of course have a giant audience here we have they saying thank you so much for 200,000 on twitch vagrants 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 virgins by right? growing in size day by day. I love you all so much. Thank you. 300,000 next. And once again, giving us a translation in Japanese as well. And it doesn't end there. It also came with a wonderful promotional graphic. Always strutting her stuff in both English and a little bit of Japanese on the side. Very interesting approach. So here we have one of the biggest independent Western VTubers. So big, in fact, that they have clips being made of themselves with Japanese Japanese subtitles. Let's take a quick look at such an example from Masaki Poke at Poke Masaki. Truly one of the West's greatest ambassadors, wouldn't you say? And further asking if we care to join her? Well, they, this might be the West, but I would say you probably still want to take off your shoes when you're inside. That's... What? What? What'd I say? What? Get out of the way. What are you talking about? What? Okay, we're going Okay, next up. We have Dia Riku. That's right. We have the freelance glitch artist. It wouldn't be a complete Vebe episode unless we had Riku here as well. A very quickly growing VTuber in their own right, showing off a number of streams where they create new art and a lot of them being around Vebe, stating, My mom is worried because I've been drawing a bay for a month. Forgive me, mother. I am merely in love. And finding a new religion here, yes. Yes, I am religious, and I believe in Vebe. And that's not the only art. We have this piece, New Operator R1 Ku, Upper Riku Sketch. Oh, I want to see more of this. Super cool. Oh, yes, and the spiciness for this episode doesn't end just there. Please welcome Project Melody of V Shoujo, VTuber Hentai AI, who you can find on YouTube, Twitch, and um, other fine establishments. Here we have the official V Shoujo account saying, Today marks the one year 
year streaming anniversary of Project Melody. Let's all congratulate her on this special day. Here's to many more streams to come. And here we have Melody's official statement of the anniversary. Salutations, everyone, and welcome to my not fun, super normal paint drying celebration. Nothing to see here, folks. A, a link to, again, a perfectly wholesome, totally family safe website for all. And in other Melody news, we have this happy anniversary gift from Heg at Heg Hegemon. I went through the process of naming a star at the International Star Register. The Project Melody star officially sits in the Aquarius constellation. This star also happens to be a binary star, so I acquired its bro as well, Science Team. It doesn't get any more official than this. And here we have Phantasm at Noble Phantasma saying, Happy one year anniversary, Project Melody. We came so far this year, and I can't wait to share another one with you. Showing art from Pi the Unusual and even animation from Crowned Clockwork as well. Quite the gift. And that's not all for V Shoujo. We have Fruit at Lich VTuber, V Artist in the UK, Lichen Style Goth, coming to us with this update. Yay, my Twitch name has now been changed to Apricot. So for those following along, Twitch name is Apricot. Twitter is Lich VTuber. We just call her Fruit, though. And here we have this awesome artwork from Fruit. Happy anniversary, Project Melody. What's an anniversary if not in a fancy gown with some apple juice? I can't believe it's been a whole year since you debuted on the internet. Thank you so much for supporting my art ever since and becoming such a great friend. I love you. Big fan of this work, and it's getting to be about that time of year. So here we have Fruit making us a little Valentine's card for us to use, stating, Roses are red, my eyes are green. Give me your soul and call me your queen. Next up, we have Lumen at Lamps Near You, your decorative RGB English VTuber companion, spreading light in the world one stream at a time. Coming in with the first lamp skeb. Look, look, I love it so much. Ah, yes, the first skeb is always very special. Hmm, that moth seems familiar. Hmm. And here we have Lumen showing off possibly what is the very last image we may see. A concept from Lumen. VTuber concept that defaults to say so, but has removable clothing layers built into the model and a stripping mechanic tied to gameplay, redeems, etc. that transforms them into a lewd gremlin. Cool idea, Lumen, but let's face it, I just showed off V Shoujo, so they're kind of already ahead of that game. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, that's not Lumen. Quick throwback to Lumen celebrating the VTuber uprising. Yeah, I'm liking it. Yeah, good times, happy times. Oh yeah, oh yeah, loving it. Oh yeah, get happy. And next up, we have Juniper at Ego Cider. Artist, VTuber, Fluffy. All characters and art are mine unless stated otherwise. Model 100% self-made. Dropping on us this cool news. Congratulations, congratulations on the invite to the Twitch partner program, well-deserved, giving us such hits as Moth Burger. Yes, we needed that in our lives. And also introducing Juniper the Luna Moth version 3.5, drawn, rigged, and birthed myself. This highly impressive display showing off multiple arms, many different eye animations, and facial tics that absolutely animate perfectly. Great work. Looking forward to more. And it doesn't end there. We also have this illustration influenced from Mori Calliope's recent Off With Their Head single. Juniper showing they are an all-around threat. All right, all right, all right. Easy there, Juniper. All right, we get it. Your power level is very high. And we also have this work from Lazuli Dracana. Quick doodles of Ego Cider. I really, really missed watching her streams while I was away. Check this out. Just loads of character bursting off the screen. Fantastic work. And next up, we have have Nadeko at Sasuke Nadeko, anime zoomer on Twitch, when they're not wearing their Minecraft socks or asking if we would wear their Nadeko flip flops, they are showing off some of the best wiggles in the business. My goodness, I can't get enough of these. And once again, showing off the fun you can have in 3D. Here is Nadeko's VRM model ported over to MMD and all its fun choreographed glory. And Valentine's Day 
day doesn't end there. Here we have the point of view of Nadeko giving you Valentine's chocolate for Valentine's Day. What would you do next? And the colorful fun doesn't end there. Here we have Spiky Hamstar. What's poppin' Ham Fam? Your personal Oni Ham. Hitting us up with their own scab action gal ham attack. This is way more than I asked for. Totes excellent. And while we have this rendition of the gremlin, here we have scaled version for reference. Always good to have one of these on hand. In the year 2049, everyone is a VTuber. And hitting us with this on the way out, no thoughts, head empty. And in late breaking news, we have other major V Shoujo information. That's right, Spiky confirming here that the jig is up. They are actually Iron Mouse. It's been an out account the entire time. I mean, it was obvious, wasn't it? And sure enough, we have Captain Krabs. Ah, yes, the captain's making it happen. Of course, we'd have the captain in for one of our spiciest episodes. Pirate Captain Who's a Crab, family friendly, becoming so popular, in fact, that Twitter is showing the captain that he's relevant for himself. Thank you, Twitter.com. Much appreciated. Very cool. And here we have this adorable work. So last night on stream, I made my six-year-old a green slime live 2D character. Got him to test it out today. Really, really enjoy these creative outside-of-the-box models. And for those in the know, the captain has been dropping a lot of very specialized merchandise. Coming to us with some pictures of both their book and plushie. Oh yes, this looks very nice. Very soft. And it doesn't end there. We even have the Captain Crab's Treasury. For kicks, let's go ahead and take a look at some of the merch. Oh my goodness, it just goes on and on, doesn't it? Here we have a wonderful colored selection of different Ahoy shirts and Hype shirts. A perfectly not at all terrorizing Captain Krabs face mask, pom-pom beanies, t-shirts, hoodies, wall flags. Oh, oh, oh yes. And the quintessential Krabs flip-flop. And lastly, we have Rasai Rui, virtual slug. I'm Rui, the sea bunny, coming to us with this news. I just got a Captain Krabs ad on Facebook. I didn't even know he had a book. Now there is some effective marketing. And here we are again with no thoughts, head empty. If only my circuits allowed for this. We we also had an in-person news report showing off Rui's IRL digs, a very common VTuber setup where she sits in her room all day playing video games and stating, I would love to have a boyfriend, but my video games are more important. It's true. It's true. Okay, no, we're not showing that. And in celebration of 2,900 Twitter followers, Rui had a awesome thread where they produced some Valentine's Day cards for followers and VTubers alike. Let's take a look. Here we have a bunch of VT pre debut at a bunch of VT. Tanuki, more like Daisuki. Deck at Deck the Land Shark. Giving Deck some full specs here. Love it. Aka Marine Raymond, a sea pancake VTuber. Please let it say where Manta be with Rui thanking Ray for the joke. Laggy, the GF tuber at Laguna underscore G8. Friendship bracelets inside. Ooh, how do we get those? Here we have Code Symbiotic and Rui just making these more and more adorable one after the next. And here we have Ryu. Congratulations, my fave sea slug. And Rui replying back with your heavenly. Oh, that's smooth. Aku at Amano Gawa Aku with Rui replying back, you're the only one for me. Oh. And here we have Chi Nero at Pixis Chi. This is so cute. Can we be gay together this month? Well, of course, as Rui replies back, we gay. And here we have Fangy at Fangy Streams. May I have a valid Valentine with Rui applying your red acted and fanging replying even further sea bunny more like sea honey <laughs> And very lastly, a big congratulations to Rui because not only did they surpass 2,900 followers. No, no, no. We are now at 3,000 sluggies. Oh, yeah. Get on down with it. All right, and that's all the time we have for tonight. Again, for more, please like, comment, and subscribe below. And check us out on both Twitter and Twitch. Have a great night.